How much damage will a robot vacuum take if it actually falls down the stairs? Let's find out, why not? Sorry, little man. Sorry, dude. Okay. <laughs> Epic fail one. Give it a little bit harder kick. Actually, not much at all. I thought some pieces would fly off. This guy's a champ. Okay, didn't really expect that. Let's try it a bit harder. Nice. This time I'm gonna actually like kick it off <laughs> to where it doesn't slowly bounce down. Here we go. Sorry, dude. Wow. Okay. These things are actually built pretty tough. One more time. <clears throat> Give it a full kick. This thing's gonna go flying. That one did a little bit more. Did completely crack this. Dust bin popped off. But I bet you it still works. And put that on later. Ooh, dirty. <clears throat> yeah, the Closing. No, oh, never mind. It closed. Let's see if it still works after a massive fall. Look at that. That's a champ. Actually, a little bit surprised. I thought it would break a lot more. This is one of the cheap, the cheap versions. This is only like $100, $150 off Amazon, I believe. So I would think the iRobots and Neatos and all those would do even a better job. Well, that's how much damage it'll take from basically gonna kicked off stairs. Still works, very surprisingly. If you want me to do this to wooden stairs without carpet, I'm gonna head over to my brother's house and do that. I bet you that would do a lot more damage. Well, win one for the D-Bot. Hope you liked, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and have a great day. See ya.